Hi guys, today is the 5th of April 2021 and it's time for me to clean out the inside of my shed. So I just got done sweeping, all that kind of stuff. And I have a lot of Fiskars products. And you know what? It's time for me to test out that famous Fiskars guarantee for replacement on anything that's damaged. So I'm going to show you what I have and what I have that needs replacing. And then we're going to see together what actually happens when you submit a ticket for replacement. Fingers crossed. I'm pretty vested in Fiskars. We've got a real mower, we've got a weed tool, we've got a great big pole saw, and a couple of other things. But what I need replacing today are this lobbers. You see right here, the rubber's completely worn off and there used to be a compressing action that no longer happens. And my Fiskars kangaroo bags are all shot. Aside from holes on the bottom, I have torn handles, we got exposed wire, bare bottoms. Um, let's see, the latches for these break off. I've got one down there. That one, this one broke off up here. That's not a Fiskars product, but you can see I got a great big hole. That's a big crack on the bottom. And I've just been using them lately for um, wood chips because they're big enough and they won't fall through. But we've got to test this fantastic brand. I'm on Fiskars.com, and the section that we need is conveniently located at the bottom. Under Customer Service, Warranty Claim. And it's actually a very straightforward form. I'll fill out this bit later, but let's type in some product info. Uh, that's my mom. Love you too, mom. Sweet dreams. Looks like I need to open up a new tab to get the model number. That doesn't bode well. This might be the model number. If this matters, I'll throw in some compliments. Uh, yeah, okay. Then we gotta upload a file, and because it cannot exceed one megabyte, and they have to put everything in one picture, I went ahead and made a collage. <laughs> Check that out. Hope that works for them. It's even a JPEG. Okay, I'm going to fill out this top part and then hit submit. We'll see what that looks like in just a second. Okay, through the magic power of zooming, um, you are seeing just the review of what I had typed and the numbers. Right above that is just my personal information and it says review your claim. That looks correct, so let's submit. Thank you for submitting your claim. If you have any questions, we'll follow up with you. If you have any concerns, please reply to the auto email you'll receive shortly. Great, let's see what the auto email is. Interestingly enough, it's dated 416, even though it is the 15th, so different time zones, but it's a lovely auto response. Thank you so much. And you can see my name, don't you know, which is fine. And typically you should receive within 14 to 21 business days. There's my case number. Cool, reference code. Let's see how it goes. So here's the last email that we sent on Thursday the 15th of April and they said they would get back to us with an email 14 to 21 business days when they have a tracking number and as you can see today it is the 18th of May so just over a month later with a nice apology for the delay claim has been processed and I should get a tracking number soon very nice this seems like a personal kind of email and it is still you know the end of covid so i was not expecting honestly anything within 14 to 21 days so five weeks later that's pretty good it is the 25th of may and part of my appearance i've been doing some gardening but we just got these delivered fiskers so let's go check them out hi okay charlotte Let's open it up. Okay. Take a look. Watch out for the sharp knife. Okay. I know. I'm just going to put the axe to loose. And, and I'm standing next to this. This is Papa. If I'm right, this should be a uh, kangaroo bag. Oh, yeah. And it's a kangaroo, so. Premium kangaroo pop-up. 
So do they upgrade me? I don't know. Or are these what I have? Either way. Hey, that's you. Hey, that's me. Thanks, Charlotte. It's not, but I do wear shirts like that. And this was free because of a warranty program. Can you say warranty? Warranty? Yeah. And that's a bunny, bunny bunny. It, it does look like a bunny. Want to give the camera a thumbs up? After opening up my kangaroo bags, I went to check my email to see if I had received any confirmation. This was the message we got last week. Um, she said that um, I would get another message with tracking information. I didn't get that. That's okay. Moving ahead, we got the packages at 2 something. I shot her an email at 316 saying that I got the bags. Thank you. Also wondering on the status of those extendable loppers. And she shot another email back three minutes later explaining that the warehouse is a little behind, but they should be on their way. I think that's very impressive. And there goes the delivery truck. It's the 27th of May. And I just got the last shipment from Fiskers, and this should be my loppers. Yep, here are the loppers. Exactly what I asked for. Uh, no questions asked from Fiskers. And these came pretty quickly after I sent that last email. I am very, very, very impressed. Well, now that those replacements are here, we can get rid of the old tools and uh, move on with the important things in life, like uh, like babies and gardening. So, have you had to file a warranty claim with Fiskers? How did it go? Let me know in the comments section. And uh, I was very impressed, I have to say. So thank you very much, Fiskers, for your wonderful products and your excellent warranty. So, if you like this video, you know what to do. And uh, happy gardening. Bye, guys.